Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome to Portal 2. Continuing off of Portal. Portal is a pretty good game, as it is, but it's lacking in a few areas, and Portal 2 just is absolutely amazing. But you really need to have the what you you need to know what's in Portal 1 to really get the full experience of Portal 2, I feel like. But anyway, let's get started with a new game. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. But what if I don't want to? Also, the controls are the same as in Portal 1. Good. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, stare at the art. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. If you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, reflect briefly on this classical music. Now, please return to your bed. Good morning. You have been in suspension for Ah, uh, that's Hello? a lot longer Anyone than there? before. Hello? Are you going to open the door? Um... Hello? What happened here? Oh, plants di died. Was did the painting change? Whoa, that's weird. Hello, friend. Why not open the door? I'll open the door. Ah. God, you look um good, looking good actually. Good, that's good. Okay, are you? Don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. Just take it. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Um. Stay calm. Prepare. It's all the same. Prepare. It's all fine. All right. Don't move. I'm going to get us out of here. Okay, cool. Thank you. You might want to hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to you. Uh, what is... Uh, table? Bed? I don't know. Oh my goodness. Everything's moving. You all right down there? Like everything. I mean, the whole room Hello? is shaking. I can hear you. Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now, you've been under for quite a lot longer, and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. But don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although, if you, do, if you do feel alarmed, try to hold on to that feeling, because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make any sense? Just tell me. Just say yes. Uh, th thank you. Okay, what you're doing there is jumping. Uh, you just, you just jump. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Okay, you know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. I know how to speak. It's, it's when you're All jumping. Reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. What? Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Wrecked. Wah. Oh my goodness. Okay, look. I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. Oh my goodness. I think I'm in hotter water. Oh my goodness. The reserve power ran out. So, of course, the whole relaxation center stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Oh, my goodness. Hold on. This is a bit tricky. And, of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? I don't feel like I'm safe why in here. I be kept informed, you know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects. 10,000? Why? It's close. Can you see? Um, I, I don't... Um, no, um... Ah! Okay, I just gotta concentrate. 
But whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, so no, I hit that one. I hit that one. Oh, you did. Oh, my goodness. 10,000 again. Get our story straight, alright? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive. Yes. Like, not uh, dead. Hmm. Yeah. Okay, almost there. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing That's a wall. Tracks. That's a wall. There's a piece of equipment in there. That's a wall. We're going to need to get out of here. I, I okay, good. This is a docking station. Get ready. Um, no, that's a wall. Um, that's a wall. Good news. That is not a docking station. I, I nah. There's one mystery solved. Uh, I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. A manual Get override. Um, Hold on. it's a wall. Reminder, it's a wall, and I'm I'm still in here. Remember, I, it's a good thing I didn't grab onto the table. Gun that makes holes? What are you talking about, man? You're crazy. There we go. Now I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But um at least you're a good jumper. So you got that, you got the jumping on your side. Um just do your best and I'll meet you up ahead. I'm a good jumper. I'm just grinning right now with how good of a jumper I am. Hey, um, Again, this place to the seems familiar. Oh, hey, radio. We are currently experiencing what happened to this guy here? Due to circumstances of I put on the toilet. Significance How do you... Our control. How... However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done, even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. The How... portal will open, and emergency testing will begin How... in three... Two, one. How did they have the protocol prepared for testing in an apocalypse? Just tell me that. Also, everything's overgrown. And it's really cool. Especially because this place lo should look familiar to us. Since it's the first test, it's test chamber. Button -based testing remains an important tool for science. Test chamber zero from portal one. If cube and button based testing cause this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Okay, so we put the cube on the button. Oh, shaking. Also, the door's kind of, kind of broken. That's okay. These doors look cool, though. Whoa. Whoa, this is completely different from the the grills that we're used to. Also, speaking of things that were different from what we're used to. Uh, this is the elevator now that we are nine 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 nine. Who knows? It just keeps going on days into the future. I love the loading screens in this game as well. It's really cool. It's the aperture laboratories. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Oh. <sighs> well, I, I, I wouldn't have thought so if I can still hear you. I, I don't really know much about ears, but I feel like I, it's fairly okay. Okay, test chamber one out of 19. Well, we should be able to do it. We know what we're doing. We've, we've... Th but, uh, it's fine. Also, hang on, this is different. Because there are buttons here, instead of the portals automatically changing. So let's just go through the portals, because, you know, that's how portal games work. You go through a portal blue and come out orange. You go through orange, you come out blue. We need to put the cube on the button to get to the exit. Uh, I need to press another button. This is very different. But this is so cool that we're in the test chambers again, Good. and it's all overgrown. Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re-entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will remind you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. That's a very... assumptuous 
thing to say. I don't know if society's gonna get much better than this. If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, semi a cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us. Oh, well, the, I guess we're not testing anymore. Maybe? I don't know. Also, what is with this gigantic turret with the crown it's, and people bowing down to it? This is an interesting virtual takeover. Hang on. Animal King takeover. That's what the guy, the, that's what the, the voice was talking about. Okay. Anyway, let's go through here. Oh, hey, this is this room. This is this room. Oh, hello. There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. A portal device? I can't see it though. Maybe like a button? Off. Do you want to go and have a quick look? You mean like like a button that you press it and then the portal appears and on no, the I thing connected to it? I well. No, that's right. Over by the podium. Yeah. Doesn't look like there's anything there. Are you sure? Oh. If you just okay, just stand by the podium and just look up. Oh, okay. Oh. Ah. Well, I'm standing where the podium was, and I'm looking up. Portal gun? Oh. Also, are you alive? That's Follow. Do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna work on the assumption that you're still alive, and I'm just gonna wait for you up ahead. Okay, sounds well, good. I'll wait one hour, then I'll come back, and assuming I can locate your dead body, I'll bury you. Oh, thank you. Alright, brilliant. Go team! I don't... See you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead. Oh. Yeah, you, you too, man. This game has a lot more character than the first one, which is just... It's so well done. Also, whoa. Also, whoa. All the art. All these walls. We've seen drawings on walls before in Portal 1, but also, whoa. We have Gladys and Scientists. All that stuff. And then we have Gladys... Using neurotoxins to kill everyone, I guess. I don't know who that special character is supposed to be, but there's also a companion cube there. Um, then there's us. Chell. Getting the portal gun. Or at least Chell, who we played as in the first game. Which we can also see is us in this game, if we looked through portals earlier. Uh, but then there's us and Gladys, and there's Cake. Also, extra person again, who's back. That's Ratman, I believe. I would, I can't remember what his actual name is. Anyway, here's a portal gun. Blue portals. So we can use that. Also, all these surfaces are portalable, so that's good for us. Let's see where this goes, I guess. Oh, wow. Hello. Just, we're already outside of the testing track. I guess that makes sense, considering we fell. Some Where are we? Oh, hey. Is this... Oh, this is the end. This is the end. What? Why? Oh, okay. <laughs> this is... No, this is going backwards, right? I'm so confused. It's like the other one chamber, but it's kind of mirrored, in a way. Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Cool. I'm glad they have all this stuff set up for testing. In the future, the far distant future. When is this? Am I asking too many questions? Maybe I should play it on the download for now. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed. <gasps> Do it! Do it! One. Oh, but the smooth jazz. It was going to help us. Anyway, it looks like we're back on track again, which is good, so... Let's grab this cube and put that into place. Let's keep going. Can't take anything with us, of course. Number four already. Wow. 
Um, well, first off, I'm going to get rid of that. Go through here. And then we're going to... Ah! We're going to put that over there. Kind of throw the cube on there. Go through here. Ah! Get off the cube, please. And then toss that one too far. Maybe? Well, not far enough. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Okay, I think I can do that. Uh, anyway, let's just do this, maybe? Thank you. Oh, broke the glass. That's fine. It's post- it's- it's the apocalypse anyway. Uh, what's up here though? Oh, wow. Unreason. This looks like where... I think his name is Doug Ratman, maybe? I don't know. Looks like this is one of his dens. I guess he could have been here in the first game, but I didn't find this place. But I don't know if- maybe you can't? I don't know. Anyway, let's go... This way, I guess. They're dancing. Also, one of them's dancing out of time. How dare he. It's weird to think that we're just in darkness as we go down through the elevator. Seems very unsettling. I wouldn't want to be going down in an elevator or up in an elevator the with the lights off. With fireballs, meteorites, or other um. Space. Please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. I think we're alright. From all that. Whoa. This is not a test we've seen before. So we've... This is a new thing. Now what does this do? Cube? Drops a cube there. So let's grab that. Like that. Uh, we can put that on a switch button thing, I guess. So we can get up here. Now, this is the exit. It's so cool that this is all overgrown like this. I, I like overgrown things. Like, it's hundreds of years later or something like that, but it's all futuristic stuff that's overgrown, I guess. That's what I really like about this. Uh, but anyway, we have two switches buttons here, so... Let's just press this one, have the portal there, and then we need to activate that to make sure that the cube doesn't fall off the edge. Just like that. Don't think we can cheese the other cube up here. Maybe we can, I don't know. Uh, but anyway, let's just put that there. Well done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. All Aperture Science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Oh, cool. That's a low amount of voltage, I think. I don't really know. I'm just a test subject. Oh, what's that sound? That's not... That's not bad in an elevator to hear that. This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. Um, hang on. Let me check if the laws of physics still work. Seems good. Okay, another new test. Let's launch ourselves around. And get this cube to take it with us. Just like that, and we are done here. Oh my gosh, ah, oh, it's perfectly balanced for a second. The ruins of civilization. Welcome, and remember, testing is the future. It is. And the future starts with you. Oh, thank you. Whoa. These test chambers seem a lot bigger than the ones we're used to. Also, the orange portal's down there. So, we need... To go over there and get that cube. It's also a good thing that portals pull you in if you're not quite on track. Okay, we're over here now. I wouldn't want to fling myself onto a wall that fast. Ah, uh, but anyway, let's put that there. Okay, and now we can do probably about there-ish. Let's fling! 
That was close. We're getting this far, future starter. That said, if you are simple minded, bold, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. Hmm. <laughs> That's a lot of information for a tribe to try to understand in the distant future where society has, has collapsed or something. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. The monitors are all displaying upside down. Oh, it's so weird. Anyway, let's take a look at this. Oh, hey, this room. Oh, hey. Oh, brilliant! You did find a portal gun! Oh, the... Do you know what? It just goes to show people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? Brave. Pop a portal on that wall behind me there, and I'll meet you on the other side of the room. Okay. But what if I wanted to do this room test where we got to use the... the energy orbs? Come on through to the other side. Okay, fine. Okay, listen, let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail or I would die. But we're out of options here. Mm. So get ready to catch me. Okay, okay, I'm okay. Off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. Okay, I'm ready. On three. Ready? Yep. One. Two. Two. That's oh. right. it's, it's too high. It's Ugh, really come on. All right, going come on, Wheatley. Gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. One? Okay. Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me. Oh, uh, sorry. Ow. I'm sure you're fine. I am not dead. I'm not dead. <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show Where, you something. Where, what? Oh, oh there. But I'm carrying you now, and I can't put you down. Go on, just jam me in over there. Okay. If you really say so. Um, yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, I'm not, I'm not joking. Could you just turn around for a second? Do it, Wheatley. Do it. I can't, I can't do it if you're watching. <laughs> just do it. I, I command thee. I will keep watching you. For all eternity. I, d I can't do it if you're watching. If you... Just turn around. But what if I get lost and I can't find you? What's that behind you? Whoa! It's only a robot what? bloody stick. A different one. Alright, you can turn around. Ow. You tricked me. Secret panel. Whoa, secret panel. Pick me up. Well, let's get out of here. You're rolling. He's <laughs> on a roll. Would you pick me up? Well, you told you tricked me. How why would why would I trust you at this point? You just you lied to me, and I've not <laughs> with that at this point. Not after what I've gone through. Okay, fine. Go. Look at this! No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Yeah, we can Hold go on. everywhere. Okay, Hang on, let me just get my bearings. Um, just follow the rail, actually. Oh, we just follow the rail. <laughs> well, that's a shame, isn't it, Wheatley? Oh no. Yes. Hello. No, we're not stopping. Make eye contact, whatever you do. No, thanks, we're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving, keep moving. Hello. Hello. Oh. Well, oh, so there's a lot of cubes just here. Probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go through oh. her chamber. And she will probably kill us if if she's oh. um, awake. If you want to just call it quits, oh. you can just sit here forever. That's an option. Option A, sit here, do nothing. Um, option B, go through there. And if I she's mean, alive, she'll almost certainly kill us. I blew her up, so I'm sure it's fine. You probably don't know about who I am or what I've done. Okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't don't go in there. Don't, she, she's off. She's off. Don't panic. It's fine. She's off. All fine. On we go. Well, there she is. What a nasty piece of work she was, honestly. Like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended up, uh, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're not gonna believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed either. 
Apparently this human escaped and uh, nobody's seen him since. Yeah. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where um, absolutely nothing happened. Yeah. And there's us escaping now, so um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch them. Okay. Um, yeah, it's all fine. Also, uh, you wouldn't mind me dropping you in here, would you? No, okay, cool. Okay, that's it's fine, you know? Okay, down these stairs. Yep, yep, yep. Um... Jump! This, actually, look at it, that is quite a, that's quite a distance, isn't it? Um... Okay, you know what? Uh, go ahead and jump. You've got, you've got braces on your legs, uh, so mm, you're set. Well, although no braces what if I drop you first, though, so just to check the to distance? You're going to have to the old human strength to keep a grip on the device and, by extension, me. So do, do really make sure you keep a grip but on But maybe I'll... Also, a note, no braces on your spine. Oh, yeah, so, yes. So don't land on that. Uh, mm. Or your head, no braces there. That could, that could split like a melon uh -huh. from this height. <laughs> um, so do definitely focus I don't, on landing with your legs. I don't, uh, uh, cool. Can I, quick question, have you been working out? No, actually. To be honest, there's no evidence of it. You know, oh. I'm, not, I'm not like just a plastic cup. Uh, we will be landing with some force, so a uh, bit of bit of grip. Just using grip, classic grip. You insulting me? Right, let's go. Jump. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, oh, hmm. I just thought about the worst thing that could happen. There. Oh, I just thought of something even worse. Oh. Better plan. A new plan. No imagining of any potential outcomes whatsoever. Okay, just just jump. Just jump into the into the abyss uh, and, and see what happens. I mean, it's not an abyss, bro. Okay. Oh, it's still there. It's still in my head. You don't have a head. You you. Ah. ah! Still being held. You did, I got you. Great job. you I got. I got you, my friend. That's tremendous. Hey, have you got any companion cubes? I could use a, a, a another friend, maybe. Oh wow. Ah, I just sorry. I just. Ah. I do not recommend it. Oh. Ah, I just done it again. It's fine. <laughs> I did it again too. Well, anyway, let's go. The only way we can go. This is the main breaker room. Let's Whoa. Go Look for a switch that says escape pod. Okay, oh, escape, pod, escape pod, escape pod, escape else, pod, escape pod. There's a lot in here. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. Okay, escape but, so pod. As as it doesn't say escape pod. Well, look at something else. Look at the next thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. You understand. Um, can you look up there can for me? Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. Uh, tell you what, plug me in and I'll turn the lights on. You turn the lights on? Okay. Okay, there you go. Let there be light. That's uh, God. Good job, Close good job, Wheatley. Oh, oh what are you doing? Turning. Well, oh, no. what's with the? Oh, fine. As long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. Um. No. Escape pod. Escape pod. Um. Escape pod. Oh, you're hitting okay. every single switch. Don't worry, don't worry. I've got you are hitting got every single switch. Oh, okay. Ah. Uh, oh, no, we're going faster now. Faster. You're still hitting every single switch. Uh oh. Oh. Power up initiated. Okay, don't panic. I'm not panicking. panicking. Uh, I can, I can still stop this. Do, do something. Uh, oh, there's a, there's a password. Okay, it's fine. I'll just, I'll just hack it. Not a problem. Oh, Wheatley, my life a, is in your hands. A, also yours. A, a, um, yeah. Wheatley? A, 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 Wheatley, a, try to... Can you do something better than that, please? Wait, did I do beat the German pen? Start writing these down. Power up, complete. I don't... Okay, 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 listen. All right, new plan. Act natural, act natural. Okay, okay, okay. Hello! Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really busy being dead. You know, after you murdered me. You did what? Ah. Uh oh. Oh no! No, 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 no! There goes a poor gun. No, 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 no! Okay, look. We both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. I don't I remember. We can put our differences behind us. I, I could be a completely different person at this point. You could just let me go. Oh dear. I will say though that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you oh dear. Really, really love to test. I mean, testing is pretty fun. I love it too. Oh dear. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. This is a long way down. Oh, crushes. Oh. Here we are. The incinerator room. 
be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. Oh my goodness. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old times. 